Hi, this is Josh Blake from InfoStrat, and I really want to show you my Microsoft Surface and tell you a little bit about it. It's right over here. This is Microsoft Surface 1.0, and uh, we've seen these demos before, but I have something cool to show you, a little surprise. So this is the Attract application, and when we go into the application launcher, we can see all the different applications we have here and uh, Microsoft Surface 1.0 runs on Windows Vista behind the scenes and it uses a vision input system. So I'm going to show you just real quick, this shows the raw camera image that it gets, so it's reflecting it so we can see it. And uh, it can see whatever you put onto the surface. So now that I've shown you that, I'm going to go back to the application launcher So, I actually lied. This Microsoft Surface 1.0 is running Windows 8 Developer Preview. So that is the start screen we see on Microsoft Surface. And not only is it running this operating system, I got the touch input to work, more or less. And it's a little bit uh, finicky in the shell, in the start screen. But uh, I just want to show you. So one of the cool things, um, I can switch back to the, there we go, switch back to the Microsoft Surface Shell and show you uh, one of the other applications, the Data Visualizer. So instead of launching it from this shell, I have that pinned as one of my tiles here. So I'm just going to launch it from there. And this lets us see debugging information about individual fingers. We can see it can detect that it's a finger and it has an orientation. And that's different from detecting things as a blob like the side of my hand or detecting objects that have a special tag as byte, byte tags. And it can see the value and the orientation of that and track it as I turn it. So, I'm excited about this development, so I'm going to go ahead and tweet about it. So, I'm tweeting from Microsoft Surface 1.0, running Windows 8 Developer Preview, and I'm going to attach a picture here as proof. So, I'll select that, and I'm cheating a little bit, I'm using the mouse, um, but that's just to get through this video real quick. So, I'll go ahead and tweet that. And while that's going, I'm going to go back and look at, so that tweet went out, so I'm going to just prove to you that this is not some uh, fancy graphics, this is the desktop, you can see the shell that was running behind it, I'm going to pull up the control panel, the system information, and we can see that this is the control panel running Windows Developer Preview. These are the hardware specs which match up with Microsoft Surface 1.0 and it's touch input available with 255 touch points which is awesome. So I'm very excited about all this and uh, of course this is a totally unsupported configuration. You're probably not going to see this in any official form but I thought it was something cool that I was able to do. So I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks.